this computer. How do you know it's time to move on from a romantic relationship? Well, every relationship serves good and good and awful. Um, but generally speaking, how do I how do I know? Well, th actually, it's quite a complicated question. It depends on the person, the level of consciousness, the level of consciousness of the other individual, and what lesson is being learned. So the answer to that can be hundreds of different answers. But in general, um, if a person that I'm dating is below integrity, uh, and I've got any clues that they're below integrity uh, as a whole, I would um, I would let that person go because otherwise I just have to learn the lesson the hard way that you know they're cheating on you they they're dishonest they lie all the time and they're two faced um, so if I if I don't get that quickly I'll have to get that the pain, even more painful way later on but generally if they're above integrity um, again you know it depends on how what your spiritual alignment you might not match with them. I like, I like the Course in Miracles. I like uh, blissing out in peace. I like meditation retreats. She likes uh, rap music. Uh, no, not rap music. Maybe she likes just, you know, going to pop concerts every day and watching uh, football and, uh, you know, playing video games. Um, uh, but she's above integrity. You just don't resonate. Well, you know, it's probably eventually it's just you don't resonate. She's at one consciousness and you're aiming at another consciousness. It's probably good to let go with love. And the other thing is, um, now, if it's if it's a thing where she's a, a lovely person, with you know, just human, but lovely, and it's your addiction at play, then it's worth sticking in and letting go of your addiction, your addictive tendency, your need to control, your need to get payoff, work towards unconditional love, uh, to give, to be in the relationship, to give, not to get. And then after you've let go of all the ru ego rubbish in you, see, then make a choice from that place. You know, I've let go of all my resentments against you, I love you, but it seems not right. My intuition still is, we're not right for each other, and then I would let it go, because you're now clear. You're now choosing from, from God, if you like, and not choosing from your addiction. So that, in a nutshell, is, um, if I think the person is quite, is above integrity and quite nice, and it might be my stuff, I'd work on my stuff in the relationship until I feel that stuff is transcended in me, and then I'd make the decision from that place. As long as I feel she's potentially a good person that could be good for me, it's my stuff. But if I feel, no, she's below integrity, or if I feel we're clearly a mismatch, then I'd, I'd let her go and let her find someone else and I'd find someone else. But if it's just my stuff and she's good, I'd stick around and let, let it be revealed. Okay. Um.